Hey guys, so I've just spent seven and a half hours in the lab, so if this video doesn't make sense, that's why. Yeah, so today was one of my 9 to 5 lab days, um, and they, they're just exhausting. Like, the lab day actually went well, like, it wasn't particularly difficult, I understood what was going on, and our, the professor coordinating it was really nice and um, like really understanding and my lab group is really small today, most people went yesterday um, and that just made a really big difference compared to the other 9 to 5 labs that I did um, a few weeks ago. I mean also I only had 9 to 5 labs like to, on one day whereas last time I had them two days in a row and that's horrific um, with my, no, just, yeah, that was hard, that was just, the last time was just really hard. This one was refreshingly nice. Um, and I think it's because um, this professor accepts the idea of failure. So he knows that what we were doing was difficult. He knew that we'd never done it before and he wasn't expecting perfect results and so like if, or like not even if, when we didn't get um, things completely right when things went wrong. He was like, that's fine. Like, he would pick out what did go right and he would explain possible sources of error, which is just... It's really helpful. That's how labs should be run. It was nice not being really, really stressed. Um, yeah. Speaking of work, work has just been busy, as always. Um, I had a big assignment for pharmacology due on Monday, which was really difficult. We had to critique a scientific paper which just didn't make a whole lot of sense. The paper itself was really hard, and then I was critiquing it was then difficult. Like, you'd think it would be easier to critique something that's not well written, but because we didn't necessarily understand what's going on, it was like, is this a critique, or do we just not understand what's going on in the paper? And that was just, yeah, that was just a painful writing experience. But everybody found it hard, and there's definitely something nice when everybody's struggling. Um, so yeah. I just have lots of work. Um, I realized that, uh, like, so that I have two live reports due with the Monday after spring break, which I've talked about before, which still really sucks. But those are my last two deadlines. So, like, I just need to get past spring break. I just need to get to that Monday. And then I'll have all my deadlines done. And then I'll have exams, which will probably kill me. But that's, like, early April, and my exams won't be until, like, May, at the end of May. So, like, you know, it's time to recover. I think I'm going to need a break after spring break. Because, like, I know I'm going to Morocco, but I'm going to have this... I'm going to have, like, uh, work to either do or to think about. Um, hopefully I'll have one report done before spring break, but I'll definitely, like... There's one I'll definitely have to work on. And, yeah, so I think I'm just going to... I'm going to need a second spring break after this. But I'll deal with that when it comes. Um, yeah. That's about it. I hope you all are doing well. Um, I hope we're gonna killing you guys and I just, yeah, internships. We'll get through it. Yeah. Yeah. Alright, my tea leaves. Just assignments. All the deadlines. All the deadlines. Alright. Talk to you all later.